Hey guys, Microfool11 here. Today we are back with some Mirneth. This is going to be episode number six, I believe. I think it's six. I'm pretty sure it's six. And that chicken's really loud. That's weird. Um, I wonder why. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, this is number six. And if you do not recall, we are here at this building that is being constructed. And the note that we read said that something was hidden in the roof somewhere. So, what we need to do is we need to figure out how to get into the roof. Because, as you can tell, there's nothing here and nothing over here. So, actually, let's go up these stairs. Maybe I'll be able to get somewhere from here. Oh, I fell. Okay. Whoops. I thought there might be some floor there, but there obviously wasn't. Um... So there's something over there that's going on, um, got some stairs here, let's keep sneaking around here, and we'll head up these stairs. Now keep your eyes open for a chest, that's what we're looking for. Um, so hopefully we will find it. Don't see anything on the inside, let's keep going up. Yeah, still don't see anything, keep going up. Aha, uh -huh, there's the chest, we got a key to Hars Art. House Aranam. Okay, now where was Aranam's house? I think it's that one. So let's get back down now. Uh, I am going to be careful still, even though I do have that um, feather shirt thing. Because I don't want to take too much damage. I'll gladly follow that one block. Whatever, doesn't matter. And let's head over to the uh, house of Aranam. And we'll see if... We need to get to the basement. We'll, we'll read the book again. How about that? Let's do that. Okay. So let's just stand right here and we'll read the book again. Okay. I received the Golden Hoe ho of Plenty from Elder Aranam. I'm not sure whether he keeps buying these thing these artifacts, but I'm sure I'll get a good price for this one. I'll try to sell it when I'm out of town after the feast. I've delivered the payment to Elder Aranam's house. I felt a little uneasy walking past the town guard building on my way there, but I did as Aranam requested. Entered his house with the key he gave me and put the money into the chest in the basement, so we need to go to the basement. I had to pay the servant to look the other way, but I er but that should be alright. I've hidden the key in our own home at the construction site of the new house. Got it. That is being built at my order. Nobody has access to that place on my position roof. Um those two visitors who reside in the tavern since a few days always just happen to be where I am. I need to make sure that I keep this journal and the Golden Hoe of Plenty with me at all times whenever I'm not at home. And I have that, the Golden Hoe. So let's go inside here, and we will look for the basement. Perfect. Okay. Now let's just look around. We've got a fire down there. Nothing going on. The basement's down there, but I'm going to check out the upstairs first, because why not? You never know, could be some goodies in here, or not. Maybe upstairs up that ladder, because there's this ladder here. We'll go up here, looks like it's to the attic. It sure is, bunch of spider webs, uh, bull, string, feathers, fishing rod, another book, and then some of that stuff. So let's, um, what do I want to dump? Don't need the eggs. Shouldn't need the charcoal, right? Let's dump it. Um, I can't remember if there's anything in these books in Quill. There isn't this one. Let's keep that one. What about this one? This might be empty. No, it's not. Just kidding. We'll keep both of those then. Alright. And we've got this book now. Um, what's it called again? Conspiracy Clue. Let's go into the basement first and we will read. And then we'll read the book. Okay, so we're down here. Bunch of emeralds. I wonder if this is what the payment was. Probably. Grab a bunch of those. Bunch of nothings. Okay, and over here, we'll have to grab some more apples. And the fish. And that's it. I'm actually going to swap out the apples for the bread. Because why not? You know, whatever. And charcoal. Don't need that. Okay. Alright, so we got the payment. Uh, let's read Conspiracy Clue. Today, I have met the contact 
and have taken the golden hoe of plenty. I've paid the price that we've previously agreed upon. As we promised, I found the hoe in the guard captain's office. I'll meet him again in a week. That time, it'll be downstairs at the prison cells. Okay, so downstairs at the prison cells. They're currently all empty, anyway. And with the recent structural problems, they are the best place to smuggle goods in and out of the watch building. Uh, uh, so I need to go, I need to find how to get into the cells, I guess? Sounds like what I need to do. Uh, so let's just take around, look around this guard building then. See if we can find anything. Because that definitely sounds like what we have to do. Uh, except there's a little path back here. There's a spider somewhere. Not sure where that was. Um, let's just look around. And there it is. That's open. Yep, that's probably what I'm looking for. So let's jump in here. Okay, good, we can get out. There's a bunch of, that's weird, uh, these wire things. This door is open, so we're in the guard building. Okay, prison cells, prison cells, prison cells, town guard. Let's go this way, because these doors are open. Uh, town guard, oh, we're inside, okay, I see now. Let's head upstairs, actually, is there anything under here? Yes, there is. Nothing in it. That's kind of surprising. Hopefully we'll be able to find some pretty nice armor in this place. All these doors are wooden doors, so we're just going to go in. Grab all the emeralds. And hopefully we'll find a clue somewhere. Yeah, that's what we are looking for. We are looking for clues. Captain's office, that's probably where we need to go. So let's check it out. We've got a clue. Yes, we do. I need to dump some stuff. I don't want to dump the books, because... Who knows? I might need the books in the future to look back on. I, I really don't know. I want to keep the clock, just in case. I want to keep the potions of healing, just in case I get into a crazy battle. Uh, I guess I... Uh, I should go back to Arnam's house and drop this key in there, because I won't be needing it. So, key to the blacksmith and captain's notes... Uh, oh wow, look at that. That's cool. I like that. I don't know that you could do this. Display the map like this. This is really cool. Nice. Alright, let's um check out these other rooms first, and then I will read the captain's notes. Okay. Got a chest, some emeralds, and a key to the town guard. We'll take that as well. Switch it out for Arnons. So, back to the captain's room. Alright, so captain's notes. Oh my god, seven pages. Holy crap, that is long. Alright. I have received the payment of Elder Arnon for the hoe I brought into town for him. I hope that the Baron won't find out about my second source of income. Although I suppose that even if he did, I'd prove too important for me to get rid or too important for him to get rid of me. Yeah, I couldn't read. Especially if it is only because of such a minor offense. I've already shared the payment among those who helped me and myself, except for the blacksmith. I need to bring hit, uh, bring the last five emeralds to him soon, or he won't be so kind again. Without his help, we'd, uh, we'd not be able to get the goods into town. So we've got to go to the blacksmith and we'll do something. I've recently spoken to the Baron's spies who've been in town for a while. They suspect Horin Warmar uh, to... I don't know, I, I can swallow it, it was weird. Uh, blah, 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 where was I? For a while. They suspect Horin Warmar to be involved with the case, although I haven't done any business with him. I suspect Arnam is selling the items to him. I hope he doesn't blow our cover. I must say, however, that the spies made it sound like a much bigger deal than it really is. I haven't obtained any dangerous items or any black magic, and the blacksmith would never handle such goods. The agent spoke of dark artifacts in the town, though. I'm not sure, but perhaps we have competition. Competition that apparently deals with unholy artifacts. 
I have no intention of getting involved with such dark affairs. I'd fear for my soul. The wrath of Aerith would be upon me. I think that's what the temple is. Um, Aerith, I think so. I shall start my own investigation on this matter. I'd best distract uh, from my own deals. And if there really is someone else, this might be my best, my best chance to side with the Baron. But first, I need to take care of the arrangements for the feast tomorrow, or the drunken people will end up causing damage in the tavern like last year. I need to make sure that this time the guards will stop them instead of half of them joining in. That is unacceptable. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to go to the blacksmith and see what's going on there. So let's go ahead and unlock this door. And I'm going to drop this key in this chest, town guard, door, bang, okay, and let's go to the blacksmith. The blacksmith is in the front of the town, I think. Uh, it's actually turning nighttime, let's just go inside the tavern and we will sleep until it's day. So let's just head up here, and I'll come over here, get up to our room. Uh, I think it's over here, your room, what was that, and let's go sleep. Okay, so we're going to head over to the blacksmith, and we'll see if he's the one that's, um, the one that's being naughty with his, um, um, the dark artifacts and stuff. I really don't know what to drop in here, I don't, I probably don't need this much food, let's just drop those. It'll free up some space, that's fine for now. And let's go pay a visit to the blacksmith. He's in the front of the town, like I said, and we'll get going over there. He is in the front, right? I think he's just right up here. Pretty sure. I guess we'll see. So, I'd say that we're doing pretty well on this map so far. I'm enjoying it a lot. I hope you guys are as well. Ah, uh, blacksmith, here we go. So yeah, nothing in those. The charcoal. Let's go ahead and open up this door. Bang. I'm just gonna open them both. So why not? Bang, bang, and yeah, bang. Boom. Let's put the key in here. Oh yeah, I need to put this key in Arnam's house. Forgot about that. Okay, let's take a look around. Holy crap, this is a lot of stuff. Um, cauldrons, buckets, iron hose, pickaxe, shovel, axes. Um, shouldn't need anything. Shouldn't need anything from in there. Iron and sh and uh, chain link stuff. Let's take all of this. We'll grab a full set of this um, iron armor. And we're gonna put it on. I think it's better than the chain link stuff. Pretty sure. We're gonna actually keep the the um the falling thing on because I don't want to fall and die but I will keep the chest plate with me uh we've got plenty of swords two swords already so we don't need one of those don't need this chain and I took the iron so that should be good we'll take a bunch of arrows though let's get a full stack of arrows that'll be good for us all right so I've got iron helmet chest plate leggings and boots Let's keep exploring. And, oh, look at that. Blacksmith's Masterpiece. Smite 4, Knockback 2, and Looting 3. <coughs> wow, that sneeze came out of nowhere. Oh my god, okay. I got Blacksmith's Masterpiece with Smite, Knockback, and Looting. Uh, definitely going to take that, and I'm just going to leave one of the swords here, because I don't need to carry three around. That would be kind of crazy. But uh, ladders... Don't need any of that stuff. I'm glad I checked that chest though. That'll be very helpful. Um, so it looks like we've got a key to the tomb and a, the blacksmith's note. Uh, he's got some food. We don't need any food. Don't need any of his clothes or anything. Is there anything we can drop here? Doesn't look like it. Ugh, okay. Alright, so blacksmith's note. I am worried. 
I've been supplying the guard captain with magical items for a very good price for quite a while now, but I fear that I might be discovered. I fear that what I'm doing might be wrong. Of course, I enjoy the benefits, all the little things that I can now afford, the little luxuries, but I'm not poor. I don't really need the money. I get enough selling weapons and armor to the Baron and repairing tools. What worries me more, however, is the talk of dark magic. I have only imported goods from the University of Arcane Arts for, well, reduced costs. But I myself have seen it. <clears throat> Not the artifacts, but people, townfolk, wearing dark hoods and sneaking around the graveyard at night. Recently, the priest of Aerith asked me to renew the locks to the tomb. I've got the key here, just finished it. But I really wonder why that was needed. Something weird is going on here. Alright. So we're gonna head over to the tomb. Definitely sounds like there's something kinda scary going on. No idea what it is. But, uh, we're gonna plop on over to... I don't want this egg. We're gonna plop on over to Arnam's our, our house. And we're gonna drop the his key in there. Because I don't want to have to carry that around. And... Um, where is it? It's over here, right? Yeah, there it is. Uh, so we'll drop that in there, because I don't want to carry it. And then... I feel like I should get rid of some of the books that I'm carrying, just because I'm carrying like a million books. So let's just leave the key right over here. Uh, Arnon, okay. But, whatever. We'll just go over to the tomb right now. Let me check my timer. It is... About 16, I have a little couple minutes left, so let's go ahead and check it out. Just run over there, getting some laggity lag. That's weird. Okay, let's eat a loaf of bread, and we will go unlock the tomb. So here we go. Can unlock this. We already checked in here. Bunch of nothing in there. Okay, so tomb. Let's see if there's anything secret around the sides here. And doesn't look like it. Let's go in. Okay, so tomb. Unlocked. Oh boy, it is dark. Oh, fuck yeah. Stop it! Stop! Yeah, I definitely did not see this, um, this trip wire here. As you can tell, oh, a bow. Bow with power, it's almost dead though. Whatever, okay, let's check out the chests. Um, bones, bone meal. Um, got a book. I don't wanna carry all this. Okay, suspicious book. What else is there? Bones, bone meal, bones, bone meal. Let's get out of here and Oh, rotten flesh. Don't care about that either. Uh, let's actually leave the key in the tomb. I'm going to pick that up again. That was dumb. So let's just leave the key there. Not like I'm going to need it again. And, okay. Suspicious book. I'm going to check my timer again. 18 minutes. Um, uh, you know, I feel like we should just read this in the next episode. I know that this one isn't super long, and I know that you guys are enjoying the longer episodes, but if I read this, then it'll start to get really long. So, you know what? I'm just going to read it in the next episode, because uh, we're already at almost 19 minutes here. So, we'll read the suspicious book in the next episode, like I said. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please leave a like. It really helps a lot, because you guys are enjoying this series, and if you would like to play the map, it is in the description. All you have to do is click the link and download it. And you will be all set to play. Uh, well, I mean, you have to install it and all that stuff. But you can do that stuff. I'm sure you know how. There's a little house over there. That looks cool. Um, so, that's about it for this episode. Like I said, hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please leave a like. And I will see you all in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Mm -hmm.